In a previous tutorial, I discussed how to use Microsoft's Immersive Reader within the Office 365 suite. Today, I'm going to show you how to use Microsoft's Immersive Reader tools on things other than in the Office 365 suite, such as this web page. First, we're going to get started on showing you how to install the Immersive Reader extension found in the web store. I'm going to open up a new tab, click on Apps, click on the web store, and type in Immersive Reader. The first extension you should see is offered by Informal Testing No Affiliation. It's a very simple and safe to use extension approved by the district. And make sure that you hit the Add to Chrome button. I've already installed it, so now it says Rated. Moving on, to use the Immersive Reader, you simply highlight the text that you want to use, right mouse click on that text, and click on Help Me Read This. Some of the tools that you have at your disposal are text preferences, grammar options, and reading preferences. For more information on how to use those tools, please see my previous tutorial. It's very short at only two minutes, and you'll see one of the links at the end card of this video. If you or your students don't use Microsoft's Office 365 suite, which you certainly can do, but yet you prefer to use Google Docs, there's a workaround to use Google Docs with the Immersive Reader, but you can't do it from within the doc itself. You need to publish the document. So I'm going to go to File, Publish to Web, and click on Publish. The link provided can be copied and pasted into a browser, or simply right mouse click and click on Go To. Once opened up, you can click and drag to select your text, or you can do Control A on your keyboard and then right mouse click. Click on Help Me Read This, and you're ready to use the Immersive Reader. As always, please consider subscribing to my channel and also hit the notification bell. That way, when new content's pushed out, you'll be the first to know. Thanks so much for watching, and have a great rest of the day.